I'm Joe Johnson. As we launch into another edition of Beetle Brunch, a celebration of the greatest group in rock history, featuring the songs and stories of the Fab Four on stage, backstage, and in the studio. I'm Joe Johnson, and this is Beetle Brunch, spotlighting some of the more than 40 songs the Beatles wrote in India. Coming up, two special guests join us to talk about how some of the key songs in India were written. Yeah, Joe. After dinner, the guys would break out their guitars, right? When the Beetle Brunch Radio Network returns after this. Once again, time to welcome guest host for this segment, musician and songwriter Tim Piper, who plays John in the stage play called Just Imagine. You know, Joe, it's really nice being here on Beetle Brunch. And it's good to have you here, Tim. I've always enjoyed listening to the show. And now that you've invited me to hang with you... It'd be my pleasure to give you a bit of the Tim Piper touch to your show. So give us some examples of the shaping of songs written in India and how they came to be. Yeah, Joe. After dinner, the guys would break out their guitars, right? And one night, Donovan is doing this picking style that uh, John finds fascinating. Well, we call it Travis picking. Let me grab my guitar here and show you a bit of what I'm talking about. And then John incorporates that into two of his best known songs off the White Album. Dear Prudence, won't you come out to play? And of course, this one in homage to his mother. Half of what I say is meaningless. John said he wrote over 40 songs while in India. Here's one he wrote that actually became another song later on. Let me uh, get on the piano for this one. On the road to Rishikesh I was dreaming more or less Sounds familiar, I'm sure. Child of Nature becomes Jealous Guy. I'm just a jealous guy. And of course, later on, one that John had to change the words on, not to give away the subject matter, so to speak. What have you done? Mm -hmm. You know, I can only guess that being away from all the madness for the first time, eating vegetarian diets and being Mother Nature's sons, so to speak, it brought them closer to nature in general. And here's a couple of tunes they did for their animal friends. Have you seen the little piggies crawling in the dirt? Thank you, George. And back to the guitar. And now Rocky Raccoon, he fell back in his room. Only to find Gideon's Bible. Sorry, Rocky. He went out tiger hunting with his elephant and gun. In case of accidents, he always took his mouth. That is great. Nice job, Tim. You can connect with Tim through brunchradio.com and at timpipermusic.com. I really had a great time today, Joe. Thanks for having me in. No, thank you. I look forward to seeing you soon. Brought to you by the Beetle Brunch Club. It's the place where Beetle fans get together to listen to the show on demand with deluxe tracks, not broadcast. Plus, go back in time and hear old brown shows, Beetle Brunches from 20 years ago today and before. Join up for just pennies a day at brunchradio.com.